Okay, now let's say whenever we want to create an event, what we usually do is uh, tap on calendar application, tap on this plus button to create a particular event. Now let's say you want to create an alarm, you open the clock application and select a particular alarm here. Uh, that is how we create an alarm on the phone. Now let's say you want to search for a particular image on the uh, gallery. What you do is you get in, inside the gallery application and uh, open the folder and search for that particular image or tap on the search button to search for that particular image inside the gallery application. Let's say you want to open a new web page on the internet application. You go to the internet application and uh, tap on the search button to open a new website or a web page on this particular page on the internet application. And then whenever you want to search a particular menu options or a particular settings on the settings menu, uh, you go to the settings uh, menu here and then tap on search. And this is where we search for that particular option. Now, is there any better way to do this? Is there any alternative way to execute these actions or search for a particular content on the phone? Yes, we do have something called Finder, which is a powerful option to do all these things on the Galaxy phones. The Finder is nothing but the search option we have got when we open the app tray. As you can see, when I open the app tray on the top, we've got the search option. I'm sure everybody is aware of this. But what you need to know is this search is more powerful than what you think. Now, let's say I want to create an alarm. All I need to do is type alarm here. You will be able to see an option here to create an alarm or add alarm right here. You can see add alarm option. I just tap on add alarm and it is directly going to take me to the clock application on the page where I can create an alarm. Now, let's say I want to search SIM manager option on the settings menu. I can just type SIM manager here and here is the search results. We have got SIM manager settings option right here when you search on the finder option. Likewise, we can do a lot of things. Let's say now I want to search some images. Now, when I type green, it's going to show me all these options. And uh, below this, we have got show more option. When I tap on this, you can see we get the search results from the gallery as well. All those images which have the green color are showing up right here. I can tap on show more to see more images in a green color. Now let me search blue. I'll tap on show more. You can see all the images from gallery are showing up here. I'll tap on show more again all the images in blue colors are available right here and we can directly get this on the finder app or on the search option we have got on the app tree this is just brilliant isn't it now let's see some more examples let's search for voice recorder you can see i can start the recording right from here we have all the shortcuts associated with the application showing up right here below the search result here as you can see, I got start recording, view recording option right from here. I can just tap on start recording to directly start recording by tapping on this option right from the search or right from the finder. Now let me search for Spotify. You can see we've got Spotify recommended options right here. We've got liked songs and all those recommended options right here. And we can scroll through it to uh, check all these options that we have. Now let me search files application. As you can see, I have got the files uh, icon right here. And below that, all those shortcuts like internal storage, manage storage, recycle bin, all these options are right here. So whenever you want to search a particular setting associated with the system application or any other application, you can directly search that in the finder to get to see all those shortcuts available right here. You don't really have to go and search these shortcuts or these options inside the application. Uh, you can just search it right here on the finder option. This is just insane. This is so powerful. We get to see the shortcut options. We get to see the search results. We get to see the web results. We get to see shortcuts associated with particular applications as well. Now, you let me know what do you think about this feature? Have you been using this? Have you explored all these options? Drop a comment. And if you find this video useful and informational, do go ahead and hit the like button as well. There are many videos like this. You can go ahead and check out the channel. Uh, there are lots of tips and tricks videos. There are lots of updates videos we have already created and posted. So if you want to know your phone better, be sure you subscribe to the channel to become a part of Apex community. Now, if you're interested in this wallpaper, I have left a link for this wallpaper as well in the description. Every video I post will have a new wallpaper so you can go ahead and check it out and download it if you like it. That's all I want to share with you guys. Thanks for watching. My name is Salihan signing off. Cheers. Bye-bye.